Hey guys! Okay, today is going to be a video on a very highly requested hair tutorial and I wore this in my fashion haul video. Hey guys! Okay, so I'm going to do a quick haul for you. I've been shopping here and there this week and accumulated some stuff. And my hair was in this side messy French braid and the thing is guys about that look I had so many guys ask me about it all it was was a French braid that I did here on the side and I wasn't I think since I like didn't try I wasn't trying to make it look good I just really made it messy and and was just grabbing as I went and I, it was very like effortless uh, that was really the secret to the look. It wasn't any special technique. It wasn't a different kind of crazy French braid. It was just a normal French braid that I did on the side of my head. And my hair was very curly in that video too, which probably gave it more texture and just made it look a little, a little different than your normal French braid. So that's why this video, I've been kind of waiting to do this video because my hair isn't curling like that anymore since I got the Brazilian keratin treatment. So I'm going to try to do it as best as I can and recreate it. But honestly, all I did was just like I was sitting there and I was just kind of like, my hair needs to look cute for this video. And I think my hair was like greasy that day. So I was just kind of like doing this and then I just put a hair tie at the end of it. So I'm going to try to like do it again for you guys, but it's really easy. Hopefully you guys know how to French braid. I'll kind of just, um, if not, I'll just kind of show you. It's really, really easy. And uh, so my hair is, now that I got my treatment, it's a lot more straight. It doesn't do those really, like my curls before, as you've seen in older videos. So what I'm gonna do is I have a curling iron here and I'm just gonna curl some pieces like right in the front just to kind of give it that curl effect because I mean it really adds texture to the braid so I think that's what you guys liked a lot about the look that it just didn't look like a normal French braid so I'm gonna just uh, I'm just using a simple like a curling iron from the drugstore and it's a skinnier one so I can work with these smaller pieces in the front and I'm just going to curl them up a little bit so we have some curls to work with ah. yeah this one um, I'm just gonna get the front pieces and um, not gonna do the whole head but uh, now that my hair doesn't have the natural curls I used to the Brazilian keratin treatment is gonna come back in about like two months now I've had it done for a month and I like it a lot so far but um, yeah I do miss my curls sometimes so but I'll get those back eventually so no special technique I'm just literally trying to heat these pieces up and curl them a little bit. Okay, so I've just curled a few of the pieces in the front. I mean, it's kind of half straight, half curly, but it's okay once you start doing the French braid, it's gonna all intertwine and you're not gonna be able to tell. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, I think my hair was just parted. This is my natural part, but just off center here. And my braid was to this side of my head. So I'm going to put all my hair over here just make sure everything's smoothed out around the crown area because once you get going you just want it all to be smooth and not have any like parts just sticking out so have it all on the side and okay what I did how I started was I started way up here like in the middle like above my ear and I honestly wasn't being careful that's the thing I was just going and picking up pieces as I went and hoping for the best so separate the top layer and you're going to want to divide it into three chunks like as if you're just starting to braid your hair. So cross over the outside ones one by one and pick up hair as you go. Make sure you're not going too tight. You want to leave the braid really loose. So make sure you're not going tight. Just leave it very, very effort. That's going to give that effortless look by letting it be super loose. So just make sure you go all the way around the head and grab all the hair so there's nothing, no stragglers. So once you grab all the hair at the end, just do a normal braid. And at the bottom, just go all the way and then tie it with a hair tie.
Okay guys, so this is my attempt to recreate the side braid in my haul video. Now again, I know it looks a little different because my hair was curly in that video, I just want to say again, but if you do this technique and if you just kind of not care but you French braid on the side of your head and just don't really think about it and uh, if your hair is curly, I promise you'll get that same kind of look. Uh, and this can help out people with straight hair too if you kind of just like this loose French braid look um, and you can curl your hair a little bit before if you want to add some texture to it which helps but yeah it's just this really effortless side braid that's really cute and it's really easy to do it takes me like three minutes to do it so hopefully you guys know how to French braid if not there's so many tutorials out there to learn how to do it and so yeah thanks so much for watching guys I hope you enjoy this video and I'll talk to you guys soon bye